Well, through the magic of editing, you guys will not have to wait for me to be back. But I peed and I got some water, so we're good to go. Alright. So we're back where we started. Uh, where the hell did I die at again? Up top, I think. Maybe? Yeah, okay, cool. Drop our carrots. Put all our clothes back on. Put our carrots back. Alright. Now, what were we doing? I think I was... Oh, yes! I remember. I was gonna go make baskets. I need to put down my thing again, don't I? Yep. To make, we're gonna go make some more baskets, and then we're gonna get some round stones. Hmm. in your backpack. There you go. Good job, chief. Out. Go. I think, I swear it's like, it's the blonde girl character model that makes it so hard to put stuff in your backpack. Because the hair blocks like half of what you're trying to do. Piss off, wolf. You have such a small margin of error where you can click put things in there. If you click on her hair, it counts as the character hitbox, so you just drop it. Alright, so yes, so we need small rocks. Now, I do this with all my bases. I do like kind of a well cistern setup. Um, it's not necessarily needed. Um, it's more of like a quality of life thing. It's much easier to water your crops from a cistern that you know you can't drain um, than it is to run from place to place um, filling up um, filling up from lakes also takes significantly longer so we're gonna make a pile up here I need to also get rid of that now that I'm in, now that I thought think about it now that I have a shovel I can So one load of carts, or one load of rocks on a cart will make you a small or shallow well. Let's uh, dig this thing up. And we'll leave our shovel over there so we can the well. Dig this puppy up. Just move it up here. There you go, you can make your well. Now my setup that I like to do is two wells with a cistern in between. That way it leaves you storage space right there for water skins and carrot storage. Oh, you sneaky milkweed. I'm gonna move this branch so it respawns.
I'm hoping wells don't get nerfed, but I see them probably getting nerfed in the future because they're too easy to make. If you have three people that know what they're doing, you can have a base like I've built right now set up in one lifetime. Yes, I could also be filling my backpack with rocks. Um, oh, drop that. Come on. Come on, hitboxes. That way you'd have to make fewer trips, but... Yeah. There. Backpack. Also, usually put a well down here. Um, still do that. I'm debating whether, whether or not I should. I should move the seed row down one, uh, like right here. But well, well here and a cistern here. I don't know. We'll see. Exchange of her carrot. Alright, we're gonna go ahead. Get one more load of rocks to finish off that. If we have enough extra, I might just make a shallow well next to the uh, next to the berries. And I know they have water right there, but you can never have too much water. This will probably be the last life that I'm going to do on this little, this, uh, I guess how-to video, but if you want anything else, grab some this. want to know anything else like building building bases or anything just tell me in the comments and I can do that I can build pretty much anything in this game right now Make that into a well later.
Actually, I've still got some rocks left. I have plaster after this, though. Or limestone. Alright. Oops. Come on. Okay. Don't need that anymore. Back here. some more candy. Damn, that one's tricky, man. Use up some of this firewood. Come on, stop grabbing that. Alright, there we go. Charcoal done. That's good. Oh, we need just one load of charcoal. Make what we need. Just leave the other stuff. Second, in time. Come on. Take what ends. Stir. See, so we can make another steel blade, make shears, but where's the fun in that? Let's make something that when other people spawn here, they can kill us and take our shit, right? There we go. I'm going to hide it behind the... Well, that didn't really hide very well, but it's part of the forge. Don't, don't... Yeah. Yeah, that's what it is. Alright, oh, yes, now I need a lot of long straight shafts. 
Let's go stick hunting. Should be plenty over here. We could also go use the three to ever chop stuff down. The rest of us did. There's like just three laying out there. We could use those. Should already, we should still have two of these left over, which is great. Probably use these to make storage at some point in the future. Carts. You stack up two of those like that to use an ads on them. Make them into fence kits. Then we need rope. Always needing rope. Yes, come here. Somewhere out of here. Fruit already. Do it now. with a carrot every time grabbing random stuff Maybe I should have made my milkweed farm a little bigger.
Here's some limestone. Please, fruit. Flowers. Huh. Alright, that should be all we need. So, we need to make a bucket. A bucket with, like I said, the uh, boards with discs. Here we go. All you have to do is add them to your fence kits. Then you have well staunching kit. And that makes your shallow well. Don't need this leaf. Now, if you want a foolproof way of not drying your deep well, all you have to do, you'll take right here, you'll take your, uh, your water skins, and what you'll do is you'll fill up from one of the wells and check and see if the other one's full. If you can't put your water in there, it means it's full. So we'll do it the other way around. Can't put water in, it's full. Or, take one from a lake, we can't put water into it, so it's it's got all 14 uses. So then you can just drain from it. I, I suggest only taking from one. That way when you come to check and see if another one's full, it's a, you'll see now that cistern's full. But if you want to check and see if another one's full, you can go like this. And you can see that it took the, th it took the water, so it's not full. Now if you want to test the other way, this one's still full. So when you come back, if this thing's empty, then you can test with either the lake water or one fill from either side. We are going to make some compost. Why the hell not? This is how easy it really is to make compost, guys. Like, <laughs> it's pretty much a joke. Now you have soil. Look at that. How hard was that? Make sure you rewater your berry bushes. That's all. Water those berry bushes, you are golden. This place not having a lot of reeds is pretty rough when it comes to almost everything. As far as after this stage of where I'm at, you can go, you can plant more milkweed, um, that'd probably be the best option, make more water skins, make more wells, uh, build buildings if you wanted to, um, you are pretty much at the tech tier cap. 
it's about as far as you can go.